1992, a few were lost that contained a consignment of bath toys. Including 7,000 plastic ducks like these. Oh, look! We've got blue duck. Blue duck. Lovely little blue duck. Not that lovely. He can eat you. Blue duck can eat you. Be careful of blue duck. While we were... Do oh, I know I haven't introduced the blue duck of death, ladies and gentlemen. You be careful of the blue duck of death. The blue duck. Be wary of the blue duck. And I think we should get Blue Duck to sing Happy Birthday to them, don't you? So here we go. Here's Blue Duck singing. That's going to be it. That's better. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, three people and many others elsewhere that we don't even know about. Happy birthday to you. I won't be doing that every day, although there are birthdays every day, apart from the 12th of July, which was declared International No Birthday Day. No. They started their travels a thousand miles off Alaska. Press the wrong bit. Um, hey there, Georgie girl. Uh, happy Fumpty time, everybody. Happy Fumpty time and welcome to Thursday the 7th of May in the 8th week of... Um, so MLW and I with Jacko over our evening meal were discussing whether it was the 8th or the 7th week because it's actually, of course, the, the 7th week of shutdown. But we started Half Hour with Hutch before the shutdown had come. It was, if you like, a little bit of foresightfulness that the inevitable was going to come down and we were going to go into lockdown and so we started half hour with hutch for no real reason other than um it just seemed like a stupid thing to do and talking of stupid things to do he said waving a duck um this evening of course is the home olympics 2020 for this evening's you need the go on to the home olympics 2020 uh, facebook page So 8 2020, 20, 20, the Home Olympics do take part. It's a piece of nonsense. And it comes after we uh, applaud the NHS and our key workers. And I want to be honest about this because when we started applauding our key workers, I thought it was a wonderful gesture, an absolute gesture of support. Now, I have to say I'm not tired of the principle of applauding our, but it feels something 